All right, we're on path three of section two in my first run through day one of map eight in Alliance Quest. We got Power Shield, Aggression, Regeneration, and Hurt Locker. So this looks like a super fun time with uh, Hercules here. We're going to go in, and I think I do throw a special one early, and then I realize afterwards that just building up to a special two and letting it rip, after, and, and I think I'm not fully ramped up yet uh, with Hercules, but by the end of this path, we will be, and uh, we'll be hitting like a truck. So there we throw the special one. We get a nice chunk of damage, almost half done. But again, with Hurt Locker, so now I have to go for a special two. Again, he's going to heal back up because he just doesn't want to throw his specials. Very, he's just turtling up there. And there's not, <laughs> I don't know. There he goes, finally throws that special two. Can get rid of that aggressive regen. Just building up to a special two. So there we go. Get the special intercept and look at look at that special two damage. Goodbye, Magneto. It's gonna be the exact same fight here against Tigra. Granted, we're gonna get some nice <laughs> vades here. Uh, I'm not usually necessarily great at evading Tigra's specials. I prefer to go for special ones uh, than trying to evade her special two. But I think we had a rare occurrence in this fight. She doesn't want to... Th there we go. We're going to get the full evade on the special two. That was nice. Now we've got our special two. We got the special intercept. Almost done. We just need to get to one more special one. There we go. Evade the special one as well. Get to our special one. Oh, we got to evade one more. Get to our special one, and down goes Tigra. That was nice. Same thing for Jabari. And again, this was not my greatest fight, but again, with Hercules, it's uh, you're never <laughs> really uh, worried. Some nice intercepts there. There, I guess I was a little bit too far away to counter that spe that uh, that special. Again, same thing, building to a special two. Try and get Jabari to throw her special. And there we go, another nice special intercept. Almost done. Again, because of Hurt Locker, we're definitely going to go Special 1 here. And that's all it takes. Jabari is down. Next up, now we've got some more community fights. We've got uh, Mangog. Again, um, truly great. Uh, time Block is going to give uh, some true damage passive for 10 seconds. Really, there's not much that I'm worried about on this one. I'm ramped up so much already. I just don't want, I don't really want to go five hit combos on uh, Mangog. Stick with some heavy attacks, short combos. Take advantage of the uh, intercepts there with Hercules. Get a nice special intercept on the special two. And that's all she wrote for Mangog. Next, uh, again, a similar community node for Mr. Negative. Also, redouble determination. We're not putting on too many debuffs with Hercules. Again, some big heavy attacks. 
similar thing try and build up to you know even there <laughs> special one is more than enough and 18 hits down goes mr negative now similar to section one we're going to grab a boss killer cross fight on this thor the thor is just a regular thor fight but we do get a cross fight to help us a little bit with the nimrod boss so hercules is ramped up fully all the way now we started i think at six now we're up to 12 charges so just a regular um thor uh, ragnarok fight just watch out for his charges. Make sure we throw a special when he's almost at zero. So he doesn't get the crazy power gain. So you can see I'm just waiting it out. I'm going to throw my special two now. Get rid of the power gain. Boom. Nice big special two. Couple heavies afterwards. And... Thor is going to be nice enough to throw his special too, and now he's done. All right. Now we have another attempt at uh, Nimrod. This one went well, I think, for the most part. Got a little dicey at the end. So, again, he's got use it or lose it, personal space, and bubble shield. Got to watch out for the bubble shield. Use it or lose it. I got to throw my specials or I'm not going or they're going to disappear but right off the bat just a couple parry heavies is doing quite a bit of damage but again sometimes I, I'm still not 100% on evading uh, Nimrod's uh, special one sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't So you can see I dexted part of it, still got clipped by the end. I would rather him throw uh, special twos. There we go, we get the full of eight on the special two. there again two out of three dexes like not a, not perfect timing there we get a nice intercept and so far it's looking good at this point but there we get the energy vulnerability and there i get clipped and now he's got an unblockable special one i get clipped by that one ah uh, and that's where the fight kind of went south but we still almost clutch this one out as best we can. Again, evading the special two, not a problem. You just have to deal with his unstoppable. Again, I'm still not 100% on, <laughs> on all of Nimrod's uh specials but the special two much easier special one easy to get clipped but here we are just trying to ah uh, see i i i was like a millisecond too early going into that so now i'm in the i'm in my uh uh i'm in my invulner like a uh, invincible phase but i screw up there i throw that special two too early do get the, the stun at the end of it, but I've pretty much wasted my uh, invulnerability at this point. I almost get him down, but he clips me with the end of that special too. So I heal up and I finish him, but I'm still pretty happy with the way uh, that fight went for the most part. So that's the end of uh, section two. I hope this helps and uh, we'll see you in the next one, guys.